The Tampa Bay Rays gearing up for another season at the TROP. Our John Sable and Brandon Baylor are in Charlotte County for the first full day of spring training where fans have some high hopes. Greetings from Port Charlotte. The Rays first full squad workout wrapping up just a few hours ago and you know what Brandon we had a packed house here at the Charlotte Sports Complex. We're Rays fans excited to be here to see this full squad in action and getting ready for this upcoming Rays baseball season. Yeah, a lot of fans had a chance to see guys like a Blake Snell, a Kevin Kiermaier back on the field for the first time this season. But just like the players, they have expectations too. They don't want to see this team another 90 win season as if that's bad. It's not <laughs> right. But they want to see them into the postseason. We caught up with a few of these happy fans looking for options. They brought in some uh, veteran uh, pitchers with Morton. Um, I got a lot of youth, Snell, you know, Cy Young winner, outfield, Fam, Garcia, Kiermaier, you know, a lot of experience in the outfield. I think if we really just keep pushing, uh, Snell did great last year. If we really push hard, then I think we can out top Boston and at the bottom at least maybe get wild card and sneak in that way. We look forward to watching them and to see what they can do, and every year they surprise us, so I'm ready for a surprise again this year. Just like you heard it there, John, surprise is the key word. They want to see a surprise this season, so we'll have to see. And speaking of surprises, a surprise for the Rays, signing Charlie Morton, one of the new additions to the Rays, starting rotation in the offseason. Why did he pick the Rays over other teams? We'll tell you coming up on ABC Action News at 6. Back to you.